Right, you guys got another quick video here for your Skype shutting down today. Here's what will happen to your data. After nearly 22 years of connecting people across the globe, Skype is shutting down on May 5th, 2025, marking the end of an era for one of the pioneers of internet communication. Skype launched in 2003, quickly becoming a voluntary tool for free voice and video calls over the internet with over 300 million monthly users using it at its peak in 2010. This free platform changed how people communicated across borders long before Zoom or even FaceTime. So what is going to happen to you and your data once this shuts down? Microsoft have urged users to transition to Teams by using this link, which I'm going to share with you in the video description. Basically, this is going to allow you to utilize the Start Using Teams feature and transfer all of your Skype chats and contacts over to Teams. These will all remain accessible through Teams from now on using the same login credentials. So users have until January 2026 to download or migrate all of their data before permanent deletion. So it's important that you act now because if you don't, all of your data will be erased. Now, the link in the video description, skype.com forward slash move to Teams with Skype, this is going to help you move from Skype to Microsoft Teams for free. There's videos on there. Microsoft have gone ahead and got all of this done for you to make it super easy to transition from Skype to Teams, keeping all of your data, your contacts and everything that you need while you're using Teams. They've also made videos on how to export all of your data. There's videos on here, so there's no point me making videos because these have been done to help you transition over from Skype to Teams. So you simply need to log in to Teams with your existing Skype credentials and their chats and contacts will be automatically available through Teams. Now, if you don't want to use Teams, you can opt to download all of your Skype data and transition to another video calling service. Users will have until January 2026 to export or delete their Skype data. If users log into Microsoft Teams for free, by then the Skype call and chat history will remain available to you. So remember, if your users do not take any action, before January 2026, all of your information will be erased. Now, the reason why Microsoft ended support for Skype is because the amount of people that were using Skype, it dwindled down to 23 million per month. And that's down from 150 million in 2011 and far from 400 million registered users once claimed at the very beginning. Anyway, I'll leave all the information in the video description. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support. Whether you're tier one, tier two or tier three, I really do appreciate it. I shall catch you in the very next video or I'll catch you on the Discord server. The link is in the video description. Bye for now.